now what we have to do we have to blanch the sheets so that we have made it for the blanching temperature below 100 degrees celsius 95 to 98 now we have to add little bit of salt in it okay and our oil so that it will not stick together you can make it al dente not fully cooked means it should be just stick to your teeth will not fully cooked and some like like fully cooked like indians so you can make it now put the lasagna sheets inside the water another one also so likely it will take 5 to 8 minutes to cook properly do it softly you can try it at your homes with the vegetable lasagna also the sauce will remain the same you can just add vegetable like jukni, bell pepper, capsicum, onion instead of minced lamb and top with cheese, mozzarella cheese and white professional sauce that you have done already now start boiling and just slow down the temperature and dip it so that it will cook from both the sides you can see we have added the oil so that why that's why it will not stick with each other and as we added salt also so it will give you the little bit of salty taste to the sheets also now the sheets are black we have to put it in a cold water by soft hand one by one now let's start making the blue cheese sauce we have taken the pan and on the gas side now what we have to do we have to add little bit of oil well olive oil sorry heat up properly and move it all over the pan Now we have to add chopped garlic for the bulgogi sauce as we are putting it in the directly of the tomato sauce. Slow down the gas. Add chopped celery. Now the minced lamb that we have taken to add it and. Properly so that it will not stick to the pan. So we will make the bulletin sauce inside this pan only so that it will retain the juices of the minced lamb also and it will give you a nice flavor aroma of the juice. So cook it properly. Now you can see the mint lamb is cooked properly. We extracted out the juices. Now what we have to do? We have to add little bit of salt and black pepper. Mix it properly again. Now you can see the bolognese sauce is 
made properly. Now what we have to do? We have to do the seasoning of it. For that we have salt. Add some salt. Crushed black pepper. And a pinch of cinnamon powder that is freshly grounded. It will give very nice combination with the lamb. So now your sauce is ready. We have to go for it layering and then just bake it properly. Mm -hmm. Now we have taken the pasta plate for the plating. So now put one pasta sheet and this glaze sauce that we have made. Put it properly and press a little bit so that next layer will also adjust upon it. Now put another pasta sheet and add the sauce. Now again press it properly. Now put another sheet and the last sheet you can make it four layer also or three or two four layer now top it with the bechamel sauce with the fresh basil leaves we have already made this bechamel sauce in our previous practical so you can make it in your home and just send the pic to us also Now what you have to do, we have to add some grated mozzarella cheese here that we have. And a little bit of parmesan cheese also. and keep this in a microwave or oven for 30 to 50 seconds just to melt the cheese now we will move to forward to put it in the microwave now put it inside it for 30 seconds and keep the cheese to melt two three now you can put a basil leaf over it you can see the nice color of it and just pour some pesto sauce now you can make it at your home and send the pic to us and have a nice day thank you very much